Are you bored of making normal CVs? Not anymore. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to create animated CV in PowerPoint which looks something like this. It will show up the name and then it will tell you about you, experience, skills, educations and you can add some contact details there and I have added to the right side some achievements and on top you can see the details of the person and when I click it will go to the next which will show you the experience and the photo comes down there then this is the skills which is animated it will show you all the skill sets and your responsibilities and then it comes to education and lastly it will show you the the contact you can provide all your contact details so let's see how we can create this beautiful animated CV in PowerPoint add a new slide go to insert shapes select a rectangle draw the rectangle to the left side of the slide make it no outline and change the color I'm going to choose this color go to insert shapes select an oval shape hold the shift key so that it will get the correct oval shape there you can make it white outline and fill as white color and go to insert pictures select the image you want to add there I'm going to select this person's image now you can see this is a, a rectangle image I want to convert this into a circular so go to crop change to si crop to size select uh, oval so you can get this shape there reduce the size and you can just add the image into the oval shape go to insert again text insert the text so here I'm just going to insert I'm going to type about me experience education contact etc make it white align white uh, font and center aligned press ctrl D and add the remaining Now go to insert, add one more rectangle and send this to back and change the color to somewhat uh, a green color and about me make it a different color, make it maybe a black. Go to insert text box and type your name here and below you can add the your position there
then go to text box and you're going to type your achievements here and you can add below what are your achievements your certifications or your blogs or whatever you can just add it there I'm just going to add the four uh, rectangle boxes. If you have more certifications, more things to show, you can just add as many as you want, six, eight, by reducing the size. So I'm just going with four. Then go to insert picture and select the picture which is the half size reduce the size but there is one problem here the background is white now if I want to change the background of the slide for example I'm just going to keep make it uh, a gray but this photo doesn't look good then so what I can do here I can go to format and remove the background so just say remove the background and there are certain areas where you need to keep the photo otherwise that will also will get cropped you can see this one So if I click, yeah, this is perfectly all right now. So the borders, the white background has been removed now. And go to insert pictures and select any a good background photo, which I have downloaded uh, this from the internet. So just place this behind the, behind your image. So this is, you can insert your own certificate image here or any other image which you like to showcase on the CV. And on the top, just add your details there. I'm just saying, hi, I'm Muhammad, and below you can add some more details there. Now right mouse click on the slide and say duplicate slide. Now duplicate slide, select the green and Bring it to the second one which is the experience and make this color uh, black and this one bring it back to white and I'm just selecting my achievements there and I'm bringing it back down just bring it down And this image I'm selecting and make at the bottom of the slide. You can reduce this background also. Insert some oval shape and you can just highlight here your some good experience what you have done in the past year or something which is you have achieved during your experience you can add the details there and you can write about your current position the title or whatever you can add it here you just add it there So I'm just going to copy the, the experience. You can type your own experience there. I'm just going to copy this and paste it here. Then go to transition and select morph. See, this is how the animation works. So if I just do a slideshow when I click it goes to 
experience and then the experience comes there likewise i can do for the remaining if you want to the duration to be shortened you can make it a shorter duration so it will come fast now again duplicate it i'm just going to delete the bottom the achievement which i don't need this now and bring the experience down below the the slide area so i'm just going to make it i'm going to talk about the skills there now again this bar the green bar just bring it down to the skills and make this as a black color and experience bring it back to the white and i'm going to insert some skills here for that inserts of rounded corner rectangle you can make it fully curved give some different color and press control d give some different color here so that the, it will show you the bar reduce the size and bring it on top of the white bar i am going to insert some uh, oval shape maybe let me just try hollow shape make it some different color but it doesn't look good maybe i'm going to change this to some oval shape so for that i can go to format edit shape change shape to oval so this is this looks good compared to the the hollow circle and select the these two shapes only press control g to duplicate it and insert the your skills here i'm just saying skill 1 2 press control g bring it down and this one you can increase the size so just adjust the the slider now i'm going to give animation effect for this go to animation select a wipe effect and effect options make it from left enable the animation pane and make this as with previous and using animation painter i'm going to paint it on all other slides the slider and 2 3 and 4 you make it after previous so it should come one by one so let's play from the beginning experience it will show you there and then the skills likewise you can do it for the education here i'm going to contact uh, this uh, selecting the image copying the image for the contact i'm pasting it on my slides and make it one more duplicate so i'm not going to 
show about the education you can do it yourself i'm just going to show about the contact bring the the bar to the contact make it a black font and the skills bring it back to the white and here the unwanted things i'm just going to delete this and select all the skills bring it down and just bring this icons to the right side and you can give the profile of each social media account bring this photo near to the contact and you can increase your email or some other information if you want to change it and all add all the profiles so let's see how we can see it on the slideshow it will show about me then comes the experience it will show you about the skills animated skills there then i skip the education go to the contact and you can see that the contact details comes there that's it from me friends thank you for watching my youtube channel and don't forget to subscribe powerpoint university see you soon with more interesting stuff till then goodbye